The United States Ambassador to the United Kingdom known formally in the United Kingdom as Ambassador of the United States to the Court of St. James's is the official representative of the President and the Government of the United States of America to the Queen and Government of the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. The position is regarded as one of the most prestigious positions in the United States Foreign Service due to the so-called special relationship. The ambassadorship has been held by various notable politicians, including five who would later become presidents, John Adams, James Monroe, John Quincy Adams, Martin Van Buren and James Buchanan. However, the modern tendency of American presidents of both parties is to appoint keen political fundraisers from previous presidential campaigns. Despite the importance and prestige of the office, the ambassador and the embassy staff at large work at the American Embassy in Nine Elms, London. The official residence of the ambassador is Winfield House in Regent's Park. The ambassadorship is currently held by New York Jets owner Woody Johnson, who was sworn in on August 21, 2017. Topic: <laughs> Duties. The ambassador's main duty is to present U.S. policies to the government of the United Kingdom and people and to report British policies and views to the federal government of the United States. He serves as a primary channel of communication between the two nations and plays an important role in treaty negotiations. The ambassador is the head of the United States Consular Service in the United Kingdom. As well as directing diplomatic activity in support of trade, he is ultimately responsible for visa services and for the provision of consular support to American citizens in the UK. He also oversees cultural relations between the two countries. <laughs> Ambassadors who later became U.S. Presidents <laughs> John Adams 1785 James Monroe John Quincy Adams (1814–1817), Martin Van Buren (1831–1832), James Buchanan (1853–1856). Equals equals list of U.S. chiefs of mission to the Court of Saint James equals equals. Topic: Ministers (1785–1811). John Adams is referred to as the first ambassador. He is also referred to as the first minister plenipotentiary. Plenipotentiary means having full power, a minister that has power to act for their country in all matters. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Ministers 1815 to 1893. Diplomatic relations with Great Britain were restored after the War of 1812. The Congress of Vienna 1815 established a uniform system of diplomatic rank. Under that system and highest rank of ambassador was a personal representative of a sovereign, and the next rank of minister represented a government. As a republic, the United States maintained diplomatic relations with Great Britain at the rank of envoy extraordinary and minister plenipotentiary. The rank was colloquially known as Minister, and the position continued to be referred to as United States Minister to Great Britain. Topic: <inaudible> Ambassadors 1893 present. Although France became a republic in 1870, the country continued to exchange ambassadors with other great powers. In 1893, the United States followed the French precedent and upgraded its relations with other great powers to the ambassadorial level. The United States legation in London became the United States Embassy, and the United States Minister to Great Britain became the United States Ambassador to Great Britain. See also Ambassadors of the United States British Embassy, Washington, D.C. Foreign Relations of the United Kingdom List of Ambassadors from the United Kingdom to the United States United Kingdom, United States Relations Notes and references
equals 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 notes